Okay, hi, hello everybody. Today we're talking about if scope and that is a better now available in the Apple website. And you can go to download by www.developer.apple.com slash xcode slash and you will see the, the page that you can download the xcode age the xcode age is include everything you need to create an amazing app for iPhone and iPad, Mac, Apple Watch and Apple TV this radically faster version of the ID feature new editor extension that you can just completely customize your coding experience. And new runtime issue allowed you to hidden bug by pointing out memory leaks. And a new memory debugger deep, deep into your object class. And in this code age, is Swiss 3 include more natural and consistent API naming, which you can experiment with in the new Swiss Playground app for iPads and it is very useful and very really powerful and new design from Apple to make the Xcode 8 is easy to use and easy to create your application such as in Enterprise Builder, in Cyclops um, it is very easy to make it and also constrain as you can see yeah as you can see here this is the screen of Xcode 8 version and here this is the new interface builder that you can see you can constrain really very very beautiful and you can see more clearly about constraint from the object to the other object as you can see here and this is the side class you can go to set to 6s or every ID right from <laughs> you can see and export change the layout is very useful and very easy to see to coding like this yes the interface builder design converts has been strongly re-engineered to make your work faster and provide greater control see a little preview exactly how your app will appear on any Apple device with a full web version. As you quickly switch between different device to customize your UI for side class, as you can see here, and you will always see the same interface of your customer. Pain and zoom are incredible. Plus, and you can even edit your interface when full zoom it, zoom out for a bad eye view of your storyboard. Yeah, in Xcode I have included the editor extension, a new Xcode extension for saw editor that you customize your coding experience to extension to navigate within your editor tab and select the modify and transform your code by your favorite extension to keyboard shortcut to make common reformatting tasks as now Xcode excludes a new tablet so you can see to create editor extension and distribute them on the Mac App Store assign your extension with your developer ID to share them online and because extension read it run in a separate process, Xcode stays safe and stable. And the new Xcode 7 editor also includes a great new feature built right in San Francisco Monophone with a new team, auto generate quick help documentation, highlight the current line, 
image and color electron and switch scope and the last one is called completion for image very very useful and very very cool feature in Xcode 8 yeah when you consider use the Xcode 8 you will see the switch 3 syntax a new syntax in switch 3 and switch 3 is the first major release of the innovative programming language we are completely in the open with the community of developer at switch.org and this release unified core API naming rule under the new public I, uh, public API naming guideline document that make writing Swiss code feel even more natural. Popular system API such as core graphics and grain central departure and more expressive and harmonious well with Swiss. You can also expand with Swiss 3 in a new Swiss playground app for iPad. Yeah, it is very useful and very really cool feature. One more thing is the runtime issue. The new feature report issue that are identified automatically by Xcode as your application running, breaking down how to find bugs that may not have been notified until your app was in hand of user. New thread generator spot right condition on data chain and on their threading re relate bugs inspect UI constraint problem use the adapt view debugger with even greater fidelity and visual accuracy and get a lot of memory leaks that you can track down in new memory debugger as you can see in this picture this is the runtime issue as you can see you can run and a trip trip your back by the 3d picture as you can see this is the hierarchy of your view of your object that you design and this is the runtime feature that you can find your back on your constraint and your design niche. And the last one is signing made easy and powerful. Device setup and code signing are greatly simplified, but provide more control when you need it. The new automatically managed code sign generate will are the asset you need to properly sign, provision and run your app on a connected app for device. Simply choose your team and Xcode does the risk. You also have an option and have picking your provisioning profile and setting up the signing process for each build configuration. If you run into any issue, improve error mistake and log are available in the report navigator. And if you have multiple Mac, Xcode will automatically generate a unique development certificate for each Mac. Developing and running your apps on your Apple device is as easy as entering your Apple ID into Xcode preference. Apple developer program membership is not required.